Paul? Yes. Uh-huh. That um, depriving the creditors of payment of their claims against the corporation? Yeah. Yeah, I just want all those small privately held companies of the employees of <laughs> every state, church, every city, uh, every county, uh -huh, all the tribal governments and all the federal employees. <laughs> now, there's this thought that you have this really good government job. Yes. You start a little corporation for your own personal home business. Yes. Maybe yourself or your spouse was involved in it. Yes. And for some reason, things didn't go the way that you thought, and you decided to dissolve it. Yes. You declared bankruptcy of your individual corporations, <clears throat> and you screwed over all the creditors. Oh, oh. Now, it happens to be that if you're a state or federal employee and I find out about it, pooch, pooch, I'm going to want to know who you owed the money to. Now, you say it's legal. You went through the bankruptcy court. Oh, could you give me all the bankruptcy judges in the United States of America? See, it's difficult for me to bankrupt myself. Yes. When uh, you're very much complicit in, yes, hate crimes of falsifying my state-issued driver's license. Huh? And then you're very complicit in obstructing my right to bankruptcy when you issue a dissolution of marriage. Yes, well, I didn't get a copy of it. Oh, and then you're so much complicit in the depriving of my right to bankrupt myself when you issue a dissolution of marriage without the jurisdiction of the United Nations. Now, for every judge right now that thinks it's a joke, I'm, uh, why don't you get me your personal home office? Uh -huh. See, there's this thought yes. mm -hmm, that we're just going to screw the guy over and we're never going to enforce the laws. Yes. And then we're going to keep doing that to our creditors. Right. And we'll keep going through bankruptcy right now. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm here to tell you, Judge, when you didn't give me any due process, <laughs> mm -hmm, when you didn't allow for me to introduce the stipulation and order and the expungement of my court record on Guam, <laughs> When you didn't admit to the court the actual marriage certificate from the United Nations, <laughs> and then you kidnapped, abducted, and are hold hosting my son, <laughs> while at the same time putting my name, my name, my name, in the newspaper, <clears throat> I'm really wanting you to understand the importance of doing what the law says. <laughs> now, this cream that's starting to rise, ooch, 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 I want you to understand right now. Give me all the bankruptcy judges of the United States. <clears throat> And every bankruptcy of every city employee, yes, every county employee, all the tribal government employees, yes, the state employees, and the federal employees that said, well, it doesn't matter what we do, it has no integrity, then there's the ethical considerations of continuing to employ right now!